Hi, uh, I'm Alicia Quade. Uh, welcome to my studio in Oberschöneweide. Uh, you can see our beautiful garden. <laughs> and we have some veggies here. This is all taking a lot of time. And because I'm not traveling at all right now, which is very unusual for me, I have time to take care of tomatoes and things like that. Um, yeah, so please come in. which I really started with Corona because I stopped traveling and I'm in my studio each day which is which I haven't been for many many years and what I try to do is a kind of a um, diary of March, April and May 2020 I'm trying to remember each of the days what a day it felt like for me so these are clock arms and it's like you know it's a day with 24 hours each symbolized by one image of this clock arm and so let's say this is starting at 9 a.m. and then goes to 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, and so on. Feels like for me, if the distances between the hours are feeling longer or shorter, if it gets faster or slower. And then I, I try things out, which I have in my studio anyways. I mean, it's like copper and soul, different kind of chemistry I'm using for my other surfaces usually. And then I connect these hours. So each is like a very unique work and is showing one of these days during this slowed down corona time. So we have this little news series here, which is inspired by a poem from Edna St. Vincent Millie, which is quite fitting to our times right now. And this is a little uh, bronze cast. And as you can see, it's um, like it is appearing in the, in the poem. It is a candle which is burned from both sides. So this is a smaller series, which I just created right now, which was waiting for a long time. So I'm burning these little candles from both sides myself until they have this shape here. And then uh, it's a lost form, which is burned out in, in bronze. We have a little summer series here. Actually, it's uh, from a series which I started some years ago and I did some kind of fruits like apples and um, I did potatoes. This was a lemon, as you can see. And what I did is that I peeled off the skin and then I, I kind of took it apart like it is now. It's called the portrait of a piece of matter, which is a lemon in this case, in its smallest unit. So you could see it like a like little string if you go deeper in string theory. But of course, it's a fun piece. So it's actually what it is. It's like, yeah, it's just a cut of lemon like this and we peel it down. How to do art here. So you can see I do the spiral here. If I take the inner part away, I can I can push it apart and then I have this form. So these are my um, quantum lemons. Mm -hmm. 